Alright, this is uh, the last battle card game, uh, the PC game version. Um, as you can see, the top player, second player, do you want to call it? That's the dice roll for the second player. This is the dice roll for the first player. So obviously, this dice rolls for this set, this dice rolls for that set. Here's the afterlife zone, so whenever you lose a battle, when one of your monsters battles another monster and loses battle, you go into the afterlife zone. For organization, you put all the player one car uh, monsters here and all the player two monsters there. Um, as you can see, you can move these around anywhere. Be careful to not move them in that direction because you'll get stuck on it and you have to restart the game. There's, this game is not 100% perfect. Uh, I made it, it took me eight hours to make this, so it's not like I've been working on this for months or years. So it's pretty good for eight hours worth of work and creativity. So you can see, you can move the pieces around. When you highlight the cards appear on your left, so you can read their effects, what they can do when you battle. Uh, the rules for the game will be in the, in the download and the zip file. Um, and of course, you want if you want to create a new game, there is a glitch. You hold and you move around, boom. You know, hold, move, boom, boom. Um, as you can see, there's a little imperfection because when you move it, it creates that. But sometimes the car will co totally disappear, like it won't be on the nowhere. So when that happens, sorry, I'm not that great at programming, but I got in this far. So this game would, uh, if, it, if that messes up and one of the cars disappears, um, you're going to have to start a new game. And this is how you start a new game. You click and it literally will open a new version of this this app and then just exit out the other one and there you got a new game now you can play with the new cards